two of the couples decided to stay married. Greg and Deanna and Jamie and Beth are still married. The other two couples, Iris and Keith and Matt and Amber, have still decided to stay divorced. Um, is anyone surprised by these decisions? I was surprised by the decision of Iris and Keith to get a divorce. I just thought that they meshed so well um, and that they got along and it just clicked. I'm still in denial. Like, I still <laughs> cannot accept it. And I think one day their paths will run parallel again. Y'all are such beautiful people. Thank you. <laughs> I noticed nobody said Matt and Amber. <laughs> I'm very surprised. <laughs> Is anyone shocked? Beth and Jamie stayed together. We all knew deep down inside that they had so much love for each other. It's just that how they communicate is like, oh my God, oh my God, somebody call 911. But we knew that that was just like the passion of their relationship. Mm hmm. It got crazy a couple times. Yeah, that's a lot of passion. Just, they just had to figure out how to control it, how to direct <laughs> that passion. And, and, and yes. go in the right direction with their passions. That passion, something. Some, yeah, yeah, it's something. It sometimes <laughs> bubbled over into something else besides passion. Mm -hmm. So, to clear the air, yeah, I was upset and I was tired and I was tired of arguing, and eventually you just crack. Deanna, if your husband had yelled, shut up oh, across no. those people, what would happen? Oh, no, no. Mm -mm. <laughs> oh, yes, yes. Yeah, mm -mm. Mm -mm. no. There's really? a lot of details yeah. left out of that whole thing. It just looks like I look crazy. No. But no, it was a lot of things at that you moment. You ran your mouth at me in the car both times, so. Yeah, you're right. I did run my mouth at you. But still, it... What do you expect? It's like you got to question how we're still together. Oh, my God. What? What were you saying? That really sucks. It really hurt. It just brought back motions of how bad that hurt that day. Um, I'm just trying my best to get through this because to see yourself and to see they're not getting the whole story, I just have nothing to say anymore. But this really is an opportunity for you to tell the whole story it or kind matter. of at least fill in the blanks. No, it does it because doesn't. we're sitting here right now to fill in the blanks. I That's really what don't we're doing. Care, like, anymore. We're, we're don't, doing. No, you care because you just on. said. You just like, said you I care. Stop pushing me to answer any more of these questions. Please respect that. I'm not doing well with this. Stop. By the way. In no way am I disrespecting you. I don't Do you want, want to answer these questions anymore. OK, all right. While many people around the world save themselves for marriage, Iris was the first ever virgin to be matched to be married at first sight. We all know this was a shock to her husband, Keith. But did this surprise anyone else? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> She's a unicorn. Better woman than me. <laughs> I am a divorced virgin. <laughs> I love that. Became line. even rarer. Uh, even ra I am a gym, you guys. You are. <laughs> One of the most difficult things to watch this season was the downfall of Matt and Amber's marriage. How much did you all know about what was going on between them while this was playing out? I think the women knew a lot more, and we did whatever we could to help in whatever way, even seeing the train wreck and seeing it derail in front of our faces. Charlotte's small, and unfortunately, some of us have connecting mutual people we know, so I was getting some information that it was that I didn't want to have to deliver to Amber, so it really sucked. What exactly did you hear, Beth? What did you hear? <laughs> Listen, I, that's to them, and I'm sure we all know, so it doesn't matter. Matt, what do you think of all this? Are you sorry? Do you feel bad? Do you? Yeah, yeah, I definitely care about Amber, just not on the level of wanting to spend the rest of my life with her and being in a marriage with her. What? what? Iris, go ahead. go ahead. I think that he just wasn't prepared for what the, the amount of what this meant on him. I think that he thought that this would be great. I'm going to meet somebody and learn about them. This is going to be awesome. Hey, we work out, we work out. But the other things that come along with it. Of course, none of us know what it takes to be in a marriage. We get that. But I feel like once Matt kind of figured out, hey, this is a lot, it was really like, mm, you know what? I don't know if I'm, I don't know if I'm built for this with you. The boundaries just never work, huh? Uh, what boundaries? The boundaries of your exactly. marriage and stuff like that. Right. Uh, OK. I, I, I hear you. I take, <laughs> your, I take your word for it.